hello beautiful people welcome back to my channel it's your girl lizzy please subscribe share and watch my previous videos if you're just tuning in for the first time thank you all so much so here is the look we're gonna be doing today and the look by my right was gotten from instagram i do hope that you love this look if this video helps you in any way please don't be shy to thumbs me up and subscribe and share i really love it when you guys do that thank you all so much so the first thing I did was to fold the edges of my gilly. As usual, you don't want your gilly to look rough. You will want it to be neat when you place it on top of your head. And then the next step I took was to make about five pleats before placing this gilly on my head. So now the rule for this particular gilly is 80-20. One hand of the gilly has to really be longer than the other hand of the gilly. So while doing this, you have to make sure that your pleats are really nice. You have to take your time to Tie, tie this gilly on your head by yourself so what I'm doing now is I'm taking the longer part of my gilly which is the 80 part of my gilly and I'm making pleats so first off you have to start by making round pleats you are making these pleats from the side of your neck towards the middle of your head and then from the middle of your head towards the other side of your head since you are the one tying this gilly for yourself, that is just um, the rule so that your gilly does not unravel. And also if you are tying the, um, this type of gilly for someone too, you have to start making your pleats from the side of your head to the middle, then from the middle towards the other side of your head. I bet you it's easier that way. So here on I'm going to start making my fan. If you're just watching my video for the first time, you would um, you would have to watch my previous videos because there I described my other video. My other videos I showed in details in detail how I was able to make fans. So you have to watch my previous videos, and I hope that you do like them. I bet you they're really going to be helpful if you want to know how to tie any type of gilly at all. So I'm just trying to make my fan. You have to make it of your both hands to enable you do this. So one hand has to be picking the plates while the other hand has to be holding the gilly down so that it does not unravel. So if you're just watching this video for the first time, if you're trying to make your fan, you have to make sure that you, you pin every fan that you make so that your gilly does not unravel but if you don't want to pin it that's good if you're sure that your gilly is secured then you can go on so right now i'm true with the 80 part of my gilly you just have to keep um touching and touching the gilly until you get that perfect shape that you want so for this particular gilly this is an open gilly but i can do a closed gilly if you all want me to do that please indicate in the comment section below if you want me to do that thank you all so much so i just twisted the hand of my 80 part of my gilly and took it to the back and knotted and pinned it so for the 20 part of my gilly I tried making pleats I just tried um, straightening my gilly a little bit and tried making folds before placing the gilly on my head I'm so sorry guys I cropped this video that's why the pleats are not really showing the boy you can please do watch my previous my, my previous videos how I make pleats um, is in detail just try watching them if you can search for Lizzie's touch on YouTube and you're going to know how to make this pleats in details it's not difficult at all so I'm just taking the pleats towards the back and I'm going to knot it So I got a request from Instagram from a friend telling me to make um, this kind of gilly, this side gilly. So this video is for you and every of my lovely, every one of my lovely subscribers and my followers. I love you guys so much. So whatever you tell me to do, that is what I'm just gonna do. So I picked the 80 part of my gilly, took it on top of my head 
and try making um a rose in front and paint it i love you guys so much i do hope that this video was helpful if it was don't be shy to thumbs me up and don't be shy to subscribe and share my channel i love you all so much and i'm going to see you all in my next video please share my channel support your girl i love you all so much bye bye